first UFC win, how does it feel? Uh, it feels great. You know, it's first time uh, in Octagon was already great, but I lost. But this time I'm so excited, very much. Talk about fighting here in Salt Lake City. We're at a little bit of altitude. Did you feel that at all this week? At first, as we came on Friday, uh, first training was 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 hard, but that's why we came uh, earlier a bit. Uh, first training was hard, but day by day was better, better. And, and yesterday we we did a s small training. I feel it's it's good, and we prepare very well for the altitude for everything. So first round, first round, uh, I wasn't get tired at all. So when you dropped him, you actually ran for him and then stopped yourself before the, the referee. Even... Could you see that he was completely out? I saw he he was out. He his eyes was closed and he was on a mat. So I sh I already was sure that it's end. Speaking of the training, talk about that leg kick. Was that, was that something that you guys have been working on? Was that like the secret weapon? I think a lot of people are surprised when they see heavyweights, you know, really bring the head kicks. Uh, but talk a little bit about their training. And about, is that something that you've been really trying to perfect? Or? Yeah, we're training. Uh, we, of course, we, every time we focus on, on every part of the game, but this time uh, join, uh, my team joined another uh, striking coach, uh, Robert Zbotowski, and and my head coach, uh, Piotr Janieski, where they both uh, are preparing me for, for this combination to finish every action with a left leg. Uh, I didn't set it in a, in the first round, I, maybe once. Uh, it wasn't good, I was waiting, waiting, but I knew earlier or sooner it, it, it would come. So that was prepared. Well, with a, a win like that, is, is this, are you trying to send a message to the division, and, you know, to really show them that there's some new blood coming up, up the ranks? Yeah, you know, when I come to the octagon, I'm very emotional. I don't think about my next, uh, uh, you know, fight and everything. I just focus on the fight. Now I'm excited after that, so now I'm just, you know, I uh, want to celebrate my victory and not thinking about next opponent. I will, yeah, I will think about, you know, in a, in a few weeks. It was a very hard preparation for that, so it was like eight weeks, very hard working, and the trip was long here and everything, so so I feel great. It doesn't look like you took any real damage in the fight. How healthy are right now? Would you like to try to get in there sooner rather than later, get another fight in this year? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, uh, another fight I would like to uh, do at the CR. I don't have any damage, everything is good. Uh, I have like, I don't know, 14 uh, day suspension and that's it. We can go back to training. Looking across the UFC's heavyweight division, is there any name that jumps out at you? Is there some that you, when you came to the UFC, you're like, I want to get a fight with that guy? No, not really. You know, <clears throat> when you're fighting, you want to be the best. So, but I know I have to do it step by step and, and that's what I want to do. It's uh, UFC, call whoever they want for me.